Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. something for you in here oh it's you welcome back I'm surprised you made it this far yes I do look a little different although I've been dealing with a bunch of these creatures down here by myself trying to survive I've also been looting off of corpses that I've seen lots of good valuables I could sell them to you but at a price of course I have all the necessities here on my tail I even picked something off off one of these corpses that were down the hall and they had something really special. Of course it's special. I mean, i never seen anything like it before, but I think it will be very handy for your travels. Oh, I also heard you murmuring about some key card. Well, lucky for you, I found a key card on one of the corpses I looted. It's right there on the table. You can take it free of charge. I have no use of it. Yes, I feel like I want to be nice this time. But you still gotta have to pay for whatever you need on my tail. Mm-hmm. Of course, I'm going to be giving these items to you for a full price. I also need to make a living down here as well. You're not the only one trying to survive down here. Oh, trust me, there's lots of things I can get with this money. You have no idea, Traveler. Mm-hmm. But I do have some special items. Like I have a brand new flashlight I got off one of the corpses. It's very bright, and I accidentally flash-banged myself while trying to use it. It's very bright. Don't use it in here if you buy it. I have very sensitive eyes, you see. And I go blind for a little bit if I get flashed with one of these beacons. Well, of course. I mean, after they've done these experiments to me, my whole body has just been acting differently. And I'd also look different as well. Although not a bad change. I prefer looking like this now, ever since that horrid day that I was turned into this. I've gotten used to my new body, and I think I am rapidly evolving from what I look like. The last time you saw me, I didn't have these dorsals on my arms or anything like that. I'm thinking the more I stay down here and deal with these creatures... The more rapid my evolution gets. But I'm not complaining. My hair has also grown faster than when I was human. I've taken a note of this, and I will be further looking into my experiment on my rapid growth of evolution. But enough about me. 
This is about you trying to get this item off of me. Right here, you see. Yes, it may look like an ordinary book, but I promise you, traveler, it's much more than that. You see, this is a Necronomicon. It's a very powerful book. One who is not very careful with reading the contents of this book will suffer very much a unpleasant death. But read it correctly and use it wisely, then you control all sorts of creatures that are down here, dead or alive. Doesn't that sound nice? Yes, I will sell it to you, but I can tell you this, traveler, it's not going to be cheap. I would like $666 for this book. And if you do not have that money, then I would like the book back. Oh, so you have been scavenging money off of people and through the drawers around here. You're a lot smarter than you look, traveler. Let me have this money, and this book is yours. If it's all of your money, then, well, I mean, it would be a good investment. See, this is why I think I'm going to enjoy your company, traveler. Thank you for this purchase. The Necronomicon is yours. Of course, of course. Anything for good paying customers. I do warn you, though. Throughout these halls, there is something a lot more dangerous ahead, especially for you humans. Although I could deal with these creatures easily by myself, I choose to stay out of the way. But for you, I warn you. These halls, they hold something even more dangerous than what you are facing on the higher levels. Yes, the more deeper you go into this facility, the more dangerous the creatures become. Would you like me to give you information about these creatures? All right, then. I can name one of these creatures off for you. Not many know of its name, but I do. Its name is Pandemonium. It's an incredibly fast creature that roams these halls. And if it sees you, well, you might as well give up. It will kill you instantly if it gets its slimy hands all over you. And don't think that you're safe if you hide in one of the lockers. This creature will check the lockers and get you out of them if it sees you inside. So, if you do see this pandemonium, you have a better chance of running away and hiding or, if it sees you, give up. Because through all my time being down here, and all the humans I see rush through these halls, pandemonium always gets them. So if you see a bunch of eyeballs inside of a gaping maw, run and hide. But that's all the information I have for you. I want to give you good luck on your adventures, but 
I fear that your adventures are going to be cut short because of this creature. I trust you for being safe. You made it down here, so you have some skill towards yourself. Of course, and if you want any more goods, be not afraid to come by. I'm always looking for great customers. Bell 